welcome to genius kiddies channel uh, back again if you don't have not subscribed to this channel please do i know a lot of children would love to watch this video so that they can improve their mathematical skill today i am here to talk about division of all numbers by two digit numbers now we are dividing by two digits not a single digit i did a video on dividing by a single digit you could download that video and watch and we watch again so that we can have a grip of what we are talking about well let's go to this it's still the same concept just that the numbers are larger and we are using two digits in division so let's go uh we have a hundred and 82 divided by 14. You need to know your multiplication table, but if you don't know, you can quickly work with it. Now we have 182 divided by 14. Can start counting 182 and start sharing it into 14. So what I need to do is to pick my numbers. Two, I'll pick the first two because one cannot possibly be working. So I'll say 18 divided by 14. I know that is going to give me 1. 18 divided by 14, that will give me 1. Don't worry about the remainder. By the time we multiply it, you will get the remainder down. So we have 14 divided, 14 times 1. Write your 14 under the 18. You use 18 in dividing, so you have to write your 14 under it. If you write your 14 like this, you will be wrong. So write your 14 right under here. Then you subtract. Two take away nothing, two. Eight take away four, that's four. One take away one is nothing. So you are left with what? 42. Now 42 divided by 14. That's where multiplication comes in. You can count your 42 and begin to divide or you do your multiplication table. 14 times 1, 14. 14 times 2, 2 times 4, 8. That's 28. You are yet here. 14 times 3, that's 12. 3 times 1, 3 plus 1, 42. So it means 14 times 3 is 42. 42 divided by 14 is 3. 14 times 3 is 42. 42 take away 42, we are left with nothing. So our final answer is 13. If you want to check, you can multiply 14 by 13. I think we should do that. Let's check if you are correct. So we say 13 times 14. If we get 182, it means our answer is correct. 4 times 3 is 12. 4 times 1 is 4 plus 1. That's 5. 1 times 3 is 3. 1 times 1 is 1. Then add 2, 8, and 1. You can see my answer is 182. That means I am absolutely correct. 182 divided by 14 is 13. 13 times 14 is 182. Now, let's go to the next question. 119 divided by 17. In this case, I cannot pick two numbers because 11 is still smaller than 17. Then I do my table 17 just the way I did my table 14. What do I do? I'll say 17 times 1, which is still 17. 17 times 2, this is, uh, oh sorry, and uh, yes, 14. And 2 times 1, that's 34. Then 17 times 3, this is 21, 51. 17 times 4, don't bother, I don't worry, I'm still going to this. 17 times 4, this is 28, that's 68. 17 times 5, this is 35, this is 5, that's 85. I'm still 
far. Then I go to 17 times 6. 7 times 6 is 42. Seven, 6 times 1 is 6 plus this. 102. I am still going. So I can still move one more time. 17 times 7. 7 times 7 is 49. 7 times 1 is 7. Divided at plus 4. That's 11. You can see. That means 17 times 7 is 7. 119 divided by 17 is 7. 17 times 7 is 119. When you have it this way, just go ahead and do what? Do your multiplication table. By the time you do it, you will get a number that is either close or exactly it. And then you will get your final answer. So we go to the next one. 228 divided by 12. Now, on this particular one, we have 22. It can actually divide 12. So, 22 divided by 12 is 1. 12 times 1, write your 12, right under the 22. Then, you take away. 8 take away nothing, 8. 2 take away 2 is 0. 1, 2 take away 1 is 10. So we have 108. Then we divide again. So 108. Now we cannot use 10. So we have to find, uh, we have to um, have our table 12. Now if you are familiar with your table 12, you will already know your answer. But if you are not, you can just go ahead and do your table 12. 12 times 1 is 12. 12 times 2 is 24. 12 times 3 is 36. 12 times 4 is 48. 12 times 5 is 60. 12 times 6 is 72. 12 times 7, you can actually uh, run it this way. For those that do not know, I just want to do that. You know, 14, that's 84. Those that do not know, 12 times 8. This is 16 and this is 96. 12 times 9, 2 times 9, 2 times 9 is 18. 9 times 1 is 9 plus this 10. So 12 times 9 is 108. So 108 by the time by the time you subtract, you are left with nothing. It means 228 divided by 12 is 19. You can check. Just like I said, you can check. You can say 19 times 12. If your answer is 228, it means you are correct. 2 times 9, 18. 2 times 1 is 2 plus 1, 3. 1 times 9 is 9. 1 times 1 is 1. Then we have it added 8. 3 plus 9 is 12. 1 plus 1 is 2. You can see my answer is 228. So if this lesson is of uh, value to you, you should subscribe. You should share and like. Genius Kiddies will always bring to you topics that you might be finding difficult to do. There will be other videos that are still talking about division beyond this. Till I come your way again, keep sharing. Keep spreading